Okay, guys, we're back. Sorry about that. Uh, apparently, Planet Side 2 is too intensive for my computer to run in concert with Stream Labs and all my other stuff I have to run for, um, well, you know, streaming. So, yeah, I'm just gonna I put the controllers. Okay, there they are. We're going to do some more, um, uh, so we have, oh, my neck hurts. God. I really. So yeah, I was um, planning on streaming a planet tonight too. Uh, get the caribou called takeover, but um, apparently I'm not going to be able to. So uh, if you want to catch glimpses of me, I guess you'd have to watch Hardika uh, Carrot. Hell yeah, Hardika Carrot. Uh, just like I said earlier, it will be, um... It will be, uh... The 19th, the 20th at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Oh, oh, sorry about that. I will, however, be playing them, so. I also hear that, uh, B-flat... And, uh, you know, Leaflet the Slime Girl, and, um, Luna the Magic Carp, aka Nemu, will also be playing on the Caribou Cult side. So, there's that. And hopefully, I don't disconnect in the middle. Well, that's said. Um,. Let's get right into the game, shall we? <laughs> Let's see what's gonna happen this time. At the monastery at Garrig Mach, the Kingdom Army proceeds to bolster its forces, but the Empire is already one step ahead. Oh, war! An Imperial Vanguard led by General Randolph, has deduced the location of the Kingdom Army and now advances with the aim of toppling Garrig Mach for a second time. You may have got us one time, but you won't get us a second! And this time, I won't fall down a ravine and be, get buried under rubble and be gone for another five years. At least I hope I will. You know, uh... They wouldn't do that a second time, would they? Everything in order here. The Knights of Seros are a powerful enemy, but we have more soldiers. We'll take them down all at once. There yeah, are more enemies that. than expected. Attacking with fire would prove most useful here. Report. The enemy has entered the periphery of Garrig Mach. If they reach the interior, we won't be able to protect the monastery. Drive them back. Uh. 
I'll comply. <laughs> Ready when you are. Onward. I do this for all of us. What's the plan? Let's make this quick. Mastered it. I'm impressed. What's my strategy? It's over. It won't be in vain. I'll keep moving forward. I'm your girl. Me lightly. <laughs> yeah, I would. Stop, oh, I'm. It's. <laughs> oh, that guy's so gonna die. Oh. I disposed of doubt long ago. Yeah. That guy's gonna die too. Yeah. Gonna... Oh, I thought he was weak. He was it was meant to be. I shall not stray. How best to... Wow, you can do one damage to me, but give me it. <sighs> it is our duty to guide these soldiers to their destination. Stay alert. Bye. <laughs> 
You took me lightly. Boom. Well, this could turn the tides. Gang up on Felix. Your death. Oh, shit. I must continue my trip. Not bad at all. Oh. 
All talk and no action. Not yeah, stay. attack me. I'll let you do all the work. You come to me. Oh, damn. He's so dead next turn. Yep. You haven't earned my pity. Take your bolt. You took me lightly. Next. Okay. Strong. Okay. 
not my That should also kill him. It didn't kill him. Thank you. Too weak for this world. A consequence of the blood I've seen. Ah. Uh, I'm really not like the Demetrius new self. Shall not stray. Fire attack is ready. Now. So many units, and you still can't defeat us. The Empire's generals are not as formidable as I'd heard. Quiet! Don't think you'll get away with mocking me! 
Attack! Make sure they never speak again! Now! Ugh, a fire attack! The damage is too great! We can't fight anymore! All units retreat! I'll take on our pursuers! Carry away the injured soldiers! Chase them down! Leave none standing! Eliminate them before they can regroup! Uh. It's over! Ah! I must leave them well. I don't want it, but okay. Not looking good. situation.
loss. But we can't just return home like this. Yeah. Thunder Year going home. Sadly. I don't like war. War! What is it good for? Absolutely nothing! Professor! Get down! Wait, what? And got his ass kicked by Bernie. Wow. Bernie's just no good. Um. <laughs> this is kind of being rude to Bernie, but that's kind of embarrassing to that guy. He got killed by an introvert. For my house. For justice. He really attacked somebody who would kill him. Strength never. Capture him. A terrible battle. Yet Garrick Mock still stands. Your Highness? Aww, I wasn't done killing people. I mean, yay, the battle's over. Okay. Next. My thank you so much. Ow. Ow. I have family waiting for me. Please, I can't die here. Dimitri, don't do it. A beast of your depravity prattling on about family? How amusing. As though you could understand. Such a thing as love? You heartless monster! You are a monster too, General. You have just yet to realize it. A monster who thinks he's a man. Dimitri! Don't do it! As a general, you must have killed countless souls without a shred of mercy. Do you still remember the sound of them begging, just as you're begging now? Or now that your life is at its end, will you hold to the lie that your hands are not stained red with blood? Dimitri, don't kill him. This... This is war. I did what I had to for the Empire. For the people. For my family. <laughs> so, you are piling up corpses for the people and your family. And I am doing the same for the salvation of the dead. After all is said and done, we are both murderers. Both stained. Both monsters. God damn it, Dimitri! Get your head out of your ass! You're wrong! Actually, Rudolph, he's not wrong. So, sorry. Am I? I can smell the rotting flesh upon your hands even now, General. Enough! That's enough! I won't kill you right away, my fellow monster. Unless you object to watching your friends die. One by one. If so, I will do you the service of removing your eyes first, so that... Yeah. Please! Please... Forgive me. Wait, did I just kill him? Wait, what? No! What is the meaning of this? I didn't want to do it. The Dimitri you once knew is dead. All that remains is the repulsive, blood-stained monster you see before you. If you do not approve of what I have become, then kill me. Can I kill him? If you insist I that you like cannot, him. then I will continue to use you and your friends until the flesh falls from your bones. Uh, you know, I never hated you, Dimitri, but I didn't really like you either, but, uh... I'm kind of leaning towards hate now. We managed to repel the Imperial Army, 
but we remain divided on our next course of action. I mean, why did I just kill the dude? I mean, an Imperial general would, I don't know, fetch a lot in terms of negotiation and stuff. I'm gonna have to kill a sister too on that. I don't like this. War is not fun. I anticipate a second and Game's third fun. wave of attack. I just like With our it. current forces, we'll have our hands full just defending. They should have given us an option of keeping him alive. It's a miracle we managed to repel the Imperial Army with the few units and resources we do have. We should probably contact Rodrigue right away to request backup. Rodrigue is in a difficult position, as he has suffered invasions by the dukedom. But there are troops who share in our cause, gathering in the heart of Fraldaria's territory. If we can arrange for them to join us, our forces will grow considerably. Fraldarius. So, Rodrigue is still alive, is he? So you did. I wonder what my old man will say when he sees you now. That spectacle alone will be worth the trip. <laughs> hmm. I've already sent word with our fastest messenger, informing Can Rodrigue I just hit that his highness over the head is alive. And like throw him into a cage or something? It's really getting on my nerves. But we would do well to send another in case anything happens to the first. With the current state of things, will be completely helpless without his support. Your Highness, may I ask what your next plan of attack is? Should we dispatch our troops to the Kingdom Capital or to the Imperial Capital? We should stabilize the Kingdom first. We will take the Imperial Capital. There, I will kill her. That's it! Give me a baseball bat! I want to hit him over the head right now! We end the war and chase away the lingering regrets of the dead. Nothing could be more to the point. You do realize how hard it is to take a capital, right? And if we lose, we'll lose both the kingdom and... Well, yeah, we'd be fucked. Uh, that may be true, but don't forget that your people need our help right now. Your Highness, I hate them too. But the citizens of Ferdiad have long awaited your return. Ink. Ingrid, I can't say anything against that. God damn it. Just give it up already. Wasting time thinking about stuff like kill that them will off, only right? dull your blade. Defeating Edelgard would put an end to the war. That would benefit the kingdom as well. We still need to look for Lady Rhea. So I agree that we should get to Enbar as fast as possible. No, 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 no. Professor. Whatever you decide, we shall follow. Ah, oh, dear. Damn it. I hate the first storyline. Okay, I love him, but... Ah! I gotta go with that one. You were entrusted with leading the church. One would think the logical step is to march to Enbar. If Lady Rhea is being held prisoner in the Empire, we don't have time to waste taking back Ferdiad. Can you deny it? Either way, we are in need of numbers. It is essential that we secure backup. Yes, if we're going to assault the capital, we need a bigger army! Plus, I feel that if we neglect the kingdom and it falls, then Edelgard would just flee there. And the Empire would flee there. Part 2. Azure if we Moon. did succeed in Pegasus Moon. Capturing the capital Valley of, of Torment. Empire. But, you know. Having repelled the Imperial Vanguard, the kingdom must now supplement its meager forces. And so it requests reinforcements from Rodrigue, who is busy resisting Cornelia's army in Fraldarius territory.
I mean, you gotta think strategical, Dimitri. I know you are uh, all... Oh, I'm an Avenger. Sasuke-like now. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, he's gone total Sasuke. I don't like this. You made it. We received a reply from my father. You should read it too. Gilbert has filled me in on the details. He tells me you are in immediate need of additional troops. I would like to say that I will gather reinforcements and send them to the monastery at once. However, I cannot afford to leave the front lines for that long. Would you be willing to meet us south of Fraldari's territory in Aelel, the Valley of Torment? Who the hell comes up with these names for these valleys? Aelel is halfway between the monastery and our territory. There, I will deliver the soldiers you require. Aelel lies on the border between Kingdom territory and Alliance territory. Humans dare not approach that place. Why? He's right. In Aelo, we can meet up with them without our enemy ever finding out. Once my old man delivers his soldiers to us, then our war against the Empire can finally begin. The path ahead will be a difficult one, Your Highness. Deadly, in all likelihood. True. But what's the point in wavering now? Father, stepmother, Glenn, and even Dudu. I am certain this will bring them great joy. Can I? God damn it, I hate him. I hate him real bad right now. Oh, uh, hello, Drago. Um. Planet side sort of overtaxed my computer, so I can't really stream it. I ha. <laughs> it, yeah, my, my whole computer went. Poof. And I had to restart. I know if I can just offer them Edelgard's head. I just know it. They're dead, man. And I don't think they'll be happy seeing you cut off your stepsister's head. And I, she said, and she said she had nothing to do with their death. Do you honestly think she would kill her own mother? I mean, think about it. Something bigger is going on here. He's so stupid! Aelel, the Valley of Torment. Uh, 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 uh. Spy! There's a spy! Can I kill the spy? I don't like spies. <laughs> I'll host a tea party because I like this dude. My room works better for me, but I am. Thank you. Delicious. Stop sitting like that. I don't like the way he's sitting. Indeed. I don't know why. Oh, come on! His ambition would be something he likes. I don't like Boba. Indeed. Really? Favorite tweet, huh? What are you? Teenage girl? I don't like any kind of coffee like drink. Thank you I don't for know a what wonderful not time, had Professor. Day Coco is. Hey, it has Coco in it. Coffee's. I hear a lot of. I don't know what that is, okay? Well, I don't like tea either, so...
Cooking it either. Hey, I'm a picky eater. I like meat. I like to eat meat. I hate water. Now if you put sugar in the water, I might drink That's a mite. Hydrate by drinking a lot and a lot and a lot of soda. I'll make the most of it. I am aware that's not healthy, dude. Well, technically, it's not healthy if you drink lots of soda and then do nothing. As long as you don't get fat. Also, kind of hydrate from the amount of free <laughs> hey, 
There we go. Void. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh yes, yeah, this is what I want. I wanted ability, not combat. Well done with that now. Ooh, the name. It should be good. Mercedes, you're looking divine as always. Good evening, Sylvain. Thank you for coming out to see me. Just the two of us meeting at this time of night? You move quicker than I thought. Uh. Hmm? I don't know what speed has to do with it, but there was something I wanted to talk to you about. Ah, okay. I probably should have figured that out. Yes, of course, Selene. Like she would be interested in you. I can be so forgetful at times. I neglected to mention this the other day. I meant to say that I know you've been through a lot in this life. Uh... Huh? Me? What? Your parents have placed a great deal of pressure on you as their heir. Uh... Mercedes? And it's all because you were born with a crest. You've had to put up with such lofty expectations. All of the kingdom's noble houses expect a lot from their heirs. That's true, but, uh, Mercedes, what are, what, what's going I'm on I'm no here? different from any other noble guy or gal. We've all got responsibilities. But didn't you mention that your brother envied you enough to wish you dead? I'm sure that wasn't easy. Uh. You know, guys. It would have been nice to know that my desktop audio was muted until I looked up. That's an hour of lost audio. Thinking about it, life was probably a lot harder for my brother than it ever has been for me. Didn't you also mention that oh well. women were only interested in having your, as you say, crest baby? Oh my god. She came out and said it. Wait, you could hear the game? in the particulars, but... I had desktop audio muted, but apparently if I don't mute the video capture device, you guys can still hear it. That's weird. I get the feeling that you don't care very much for these women who throw themselves at you. Really, Miss Hades? It takes you this long to figure that um. out? I'd appreciate it if maybe you kept that observation between the two of us. Oh, she called him out. Your secret's safe with me. <laughs> I understand the pain you've had to carry. I know you've got your share of bad memories too, but... 
That's why you feel comfortable letting your guard down around me. Come now. That's enough with the sad smile. Um, Mercedes. Was my sad smile really that bad? Did it ruin my dashing good looks? Wait. So I can mute my desktop audio. You guys can still hear the game and I can look at other stuff. Why I'm watching. Okay. <laughs> good to know. Not at all. You actually look more handsome to me with honesty on your face. I know. Oh. Aw. Here come the waterworks. Aw. Don't be ashamed of crying. I'm here to protect you. God damn it, Mercedes. Will you protect me in return? Wait, what? I will. I promise. You know, Mercedes, you really are a special lady. Uh, that might not be a bad tip. I don't know if I'd tip it, but... Yay, let's look at this one. Training on your own? You really do work hard. I hate to break it to you, Sylvain, but there's nobody here for you to flirt with. So there's not much reason to hang around. Oh! Oh! No, I was not trying to romance Mercedes. I mean, she's nice and everything, but, uh... Yeah, not my type. She, she's a good fan. Uh, You're here, aren't you? How ridiculous. Almost as ridiculous as your face. <laughs> Did she just say you're... Did she just fucking say uh, your face? Insult? What is this? 2000? Or was that 2002? I don't know, it's one of You'd really say something like that to a handsome guy like me? I'm crushed. Oh, come on, Selene. You know she was gonna say that shit, and you know it's true. Uh, who am I trying to romance? Uh, I don't know. Uh, and that? Probably. Joking aside, may I join you? I only came out here so I could train too. Sure, just don't get in my way. I've been thinking about it, and I really depend on you. Maybe that's weird since I'm older than you, but still. Hitting on me? Again? Have some dignity, would you? How come every time he hits on you, you... Hey, maybe... Uh, whatever, I can't do it. He hits on everything with a pulse. I can't bring myself to say maybe he's... Yeah. No, I'm being honest. I thought you'd listen. No, he's not hitting on you. Hey. I'd like it if you didn't get too far away from me on the battlefield, okay? Or is that just, just what he stay wants where I can you to see think? You. I'll stay as long as I can. You're useless without me, after all. Aww. What? No, I'm saying if there's one thing I can do on the battlefield, it's keep you safe. <laughs> Whatever helps you feel better. Don't <laughs> oh. me, then. Oh, God. He's... Totally destroying it. I couldn't bear it if you went off and died on me while I wasn't around. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's my line. Oh. It's getting late. We'd better head out. You're right. You haven't been practicing enough. All that time you waste chasing after women would be better spent training. I'll train with you anytime, so just... Hmm? What's that strange look for? I just... Oh, well... 
You're going to think I'm being a jerk or hitting on you or whatever. When we're side by side like this, training, I feel, I don't know, oddly at ease. I know what you mean. It's probably because we've been friends for so long. <sighs> that must be it. Let's never change. Friends forever? <laughs> Absolutely. No matter what happens, we'll always be friends, Sylvain. And there's it. Friend zone. Although technically, I guess you could get out of it. <sighs> oh, Professor, here's the map you... Well, there's always next time, I suppose. Speak up, mother... Oh my god, Ignis. Ignat. Speak up. Hey, Ignatz! Didn't you have something to talk to the professor about? Oh no, nothing urgent. You didn't cut short your conversation because of me, did you? Come on, do I seem like the type to do that? No, I just had a couple of questions about the bows. We're done now, so I thought I'd come and tell you. The bows? Is something wrong with them? Lots of them have come in for repairs lately, so I switched out some of the strings for stronger ones. They've been breaking less, but now they're harder to draw. Why does he do that? I don't know if you guys heard that, but my roommate just beamed out loud again. Ah, I see. I don't know why I he suppose did. people would prefer if you went back to the lighter bowstrings. Maybe. If the only issue was the draw weight, I'd just tell people to get stronger arms. Uh... Leone... I'm pretty sure people would hate you for that. But the real problem is that you can't shoot as fast. The arrows also fly too far now. That is a problem. Wait, that's not a problem! Well, the not shooting as fast isn't a problem. Well, wait, no, the not shooting as fast is a problem, but the arrows flying too far is not a problem. I can see how slower shooting is a drawback, but the arrows flying farther, that actually sounds like a good thing. Sure, on open planes, but up close you lose accuracy. Uh, she has a point there. I didn't think about that. That's why I thought it might be good to use different bowstrings for different scenarios. I wanted the professor's opinion about that. You know, that's why there are different bow types, Leone. Oh, good point. You know a lot about bows, don't you? Yes, I do. I grew up in a hunting village, so I've been around them my whole life. <laughs> I wouldn't say I'm necessarily better than anyone, but at least I know what I'm doing. And you? Do you have something you're really good at? <laughs> Me? Oh, no. I, I don't think so. Oh, my God, dude. Grow a spine. Well... I'm sure you'll find your thing someday. I hope so. Oh, I don't like him. Maybe he'll grow his mind. I don't like him.
Come on. Probably gonna fail. Oh, okay, there. It worked. Never mind. <laughs> there we go. Only one time this month. Yay! Stealing myself to see my father again. I can't stand that old man. Yes, I do. Above all, I hate the crazed nonsense that comes out of his mouth. Uh, Felix. Wow, Felix. Wow, that. Wow. It seems Arianro, one of the kingdom's sturdiest fortress cities, has fallen to the Empire. It looks like Count Ro didn't resist, and switched sides to the Empire straight away. Well, I guess we're gonna have to hang him. Repaying all that the royal family Boy, has done for him with again. betrayal. How shameful. Oh, a land tournament, is it? There's only one person I can say for Lance. I'm gonna win. I aim for greatness. Free money! It is done. Onward. Nick? Well. Next try! My duty is your death. Eh, might as well. Next try. Really? I aim for greatness. Hello, oh well. free money. I aim for greatness. And I won the tournament. Give me that free silver lamp. And the money. I want the money more. <laughs> money, money falling all around me. is that thank you somebody that shares my what the fuck who's naming this place this thing that sounds scary do i really have to go with you hey um here's an idea maybe let the recluse stay home and hold the fort no 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 bernie you have to come out of there I don't think you take that invite. Um, 
What is it? Thanks so much. Hot, hot, hot. Okay, the cat. That was a no-brainer. Huh? Oh, come on! Wait. I didn't mean... Oh. I didn't mean to say the same thing. Apparently, introverts think they're like. Thank you. Wow. That for another time. Yep. I forgot to check a room. Nope. Okay, down the stairs. I checked these rooms. Nope. 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 Clean out the storerooms, tend the flowers, do the washing, dust the library. No, this Might is my well. job. Lady Rhea herself gave it to me. Dude! She's missing! Even if Lady Rhea's not here right now, I still gotta do my duty. God, you're such a pimp. Like you. You gotta have other stuff you ought to be doing, yeah? Hey kid, you realize you're a simp, right? <laughs> uh, nope. Nope. Oh, check the stuff that will raise my professor level. So tedious. But it has to be done. I have to know. No. 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 <laughs> no. Nope. Last room. Nothing this one. Okay. By the way, the K 
Kingdom Capital or the Imperial Capital. If we tried to take on the Empire like this, with House Fraldarius under attack, they probably can't spare many. On the other hand, if we did manage to take the Imperial Capital, mm, I'm not no true. good at thinking through this kind of complicated stuff. I still think there's something going on behind the scenes, so I'd like to stabilize everything first. Uh -huh. That's it. Oh, I need to look at the calories. <laughs> no. Oh, this is the mystery. <laughs> If we can take back the kingdom, we'll recover our soldiers. And some food and supplies too, I bet. Most importantly of all, there are people in the kingdom waiting for our help. Even His Highness understands that, I'm sure of it. Yet, he wants to take on the Empire despite all that. It's because he's gone crazy. Do you think he just doesn't care about anything other than fighting Edelgard anymore? Yeah, I'm pretty sure he doesn't. But if not, then why? Go back to normal. Hey, how about a favor? Wait, a secret shop? I'm in. Hello there. Return soon, please. Professor? Greetings, Professor. Nothing to report. Is everyone setting out on a big campaign? Not exactly. Ah, well, you can leave guarding this place to me. I'll keep an eye out for anything suspicious. There's a spy in our midst. I blame you, gatekeeper. I also blame other people more. After all, you're just assigned to watch the gate. It's not like you'd notice the spy coming in with the rest of the army. AOL, the Valley of Torment. Oh man, I really do not want to go there. Why? It sounds fun! That place is crazy hot. For guys like me, who grew up somewhere cold, man, it's gonna be rough. Wait, is it just called the Valley of Torment because it's hot? No. I guess that climate will keep our enemies at bay. This experience. Can you help me?
Enemy spies around. Remain vigilant. Oh, he knows. <laughs> Capture anyone who seems suspicious. I'm glad you understand. Some of our friends believe that if we get those reinforcements, we'll be set for provisions, too. But I think it's best not to hold our breath on the food front. With the added headcount from the reinforcements, there will be even more mouths to feed. That's true. I don't see why people would think, Hey, we're getting more food! Yay! But we're also getting more people to feed. The kingdom doesn't seem to have clear goals holding them together. Different people have different priorities. The situation right now is difficult. But at times like this, you have the opportunity to really shine, eh, Professor? Uh, again. You're in charge. Show them what you're made of. I'll... Yeah, I don't care what you do. I'm just gonna say it. I don't like you. I don't know about everyone else. But heading to the Empire seems like a good idea to me. That doesn't seem like a good idea. The search for Lady Rhea will be so much easier if we can just get the Empire out of the way. Yes, but just because we defeat the Empire doesn't mean we win. I suppose Dimitri <laughs> might still pose a problem, though. He seems so fixated on the Imperial capital, but I get the feeling he's not even sure what he wants anymore. Really? I'm pretty sure he wants Edelgard's head. But that's just me. This is all a bit troubling, isn't it? The people from the kingdom seem to be of two minds as well. Can we really plan to fight when we're this unsure of ourselves? You think once we're face to face with the enemy, it might help us band together? I hope so. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. This ex... There we go. Uh, yep, that's enough. I appreciate any good meal, but that looks happy. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> Let's you my cooking talent. A little more secret spice and... Hey! No peeking! Oh. 
Okay. teacher anymore and we're not your students but everyone still calls you professor is there something you'd rather be called Hello? oh all right then i'll call you Ugh, nope sorry can't do it too weird <laughs> oh <Ryore. laughs> uh. Okay, I'll call you. I can't. Uh, twenty. Okay. And we'll send the move. Uh. You know, I just thought of this, but I'm selling loose meat. These past five years, Lord Rodrigue worried for his highness more than any other. But I wonder what he would say if he saw what has become of Dimitri. Well, he's gonna see it very soon. I have a request. Thank you very much. No idea what the resources were, but... Whatever. I concur. Hello. Say now. To the north of Garrig Mach lie the territories of the Karen and Galatea houses, former lords of the kingdom. Even though their territory is being nibbled at by the Empire, they are still clinging to their neutrality. Seriously? Since they only display enough force to defend their borders, I suppose the Empire has no incentive to attack them with any real strength. Hmm. Okay. I don't care if they're just nibbling at them, that's still technically an attack. Meeting reinforcements in the Valley of Torment seems an astute decision to me. In that land of oppressive heat, it is unlikely that we will be disturbed. And yet, I think we're about gonna be attacked. It also means we will need to contend with those harsh conditions ourselves, however. Best ensure we are well prepared. Right. Oh, it has been only five years, yet so much has changed. You haven't, which makes me question how old you are, again! Half of the kingdom has fallen to the Empire. Skirmishes are rife throughout the Alliance. Despite such tumult, 
we look upon the same sky, unchanged by the storm happening beneath it. Indeed, I gazed up at the same sky with mother and father. It does not feel so long ago at all. Wait, but how would you know, Professor? <laughs> because I'm the protagonist and I know all. It has been only five. Oh, I already found it. Huh. Uh, I hate having to wait for the gate to open. As long as this game exists, I'm gonna complain about this. I can't believe how long it's been since I left home. Since I was dragged out of the house, I mean. Five whole years. It's weird to think about. Wait, you didn't go home when, uh, you know. Wait, what were you doing those five years? But if you'd asked me that five years ago, I'd have said the opposite. I have friends here, and I have you. Ooh. The monastery's become a second home to me. Back then, I never would have dreamed a day like this would come. It's all thanks to you. You've given me a second chance at life. If not for you, I never would have gotten used to leaving my room, let alone the monastery. Aww. Maybe the battlefields just told my senses. I'm much better with strangers and new places now, though. I don't panic nearly as much as before. A new place? All on my own? That sounds like a tough assignment. Where did this come from all of a sudden? Hey, hold on. You're teasing me, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Please don't joke around like that anymore. It's torture for me. But you're so cute when you're being teased. Come on, Professor. I'm begging you. Please promise me you won't do that again. Friends respect each other's feelings, don't they? Oh, Good. fine. I'll hold you to that. You're absolutely not allowed to send me out anywhere on my own. Got it? Uh... You would need to come with me. If you're with me, I can go anywhere in the world. Aww. No, that defeats the purpose. Why can't you get what I'm saying? Oh, I get it. I don't know why they won't give me the option to get it yet. I thought we were finally getting close. I guess I'm not good enough for that, though, am I? I'll let you have this one, but you better be ready for next time. I already know what she's saying, but they didn't give me the option. <sighs> That's because it was a fucking confession! <laughs> I don't know why they won't let me take it. Yeah, see, she's S rank now, too. S, 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 S. Who else is S? S. S. Let's see, how many more can I get to fall from me? One. Two. Play. Don't care. Don't care. Four. Five. Don't care. I don't care about her either. Technically, I don't care, but you know, the completionist in me says do it.
Professor! That was such a confession. And yet, the game says, nope, you can't be confessed to yet. Go away. Go away. Hello, pile of rocks. I wish I could pick you up and throw you at a certain somebody. Need something? See you again soon. It is imperative that we regroup with those who continue to resist. Most importantly, we must join up with the Fraldarius family. If we do, our ability to reclaim the Kingdom capital is ensured. We should aim for this outcome, rather than focusing our efforts on the Imperial capital. This seems to me the best strategy at present. But I feel what His Highness feels. His hatred, his anger, so keenly, as if it were my own. So I find it difficult to oppose his wishes. Yes, but his wishes are mass murder. Okay, maybe not mass mur- Well, yeah, mass murder. Oh. I have lived inconspicuously these past five years, so as not to be discovered by the Empire. To be able to finally return to the monastery again is overwhelming. I hope that our brothers and sisters who ran far away will also return one day. Maybe. Singing is so much fun. Everyone should enjoy themselves well. This is no good. Sing from your diaphragm. In an attempt to clean my room, I tried to throw out the things I no longer need, but I can't bring myself to do it. After all, I can't just throw away precious memories, right? I really hate that person. Hello there. Hello there. Well, then. The monastery repairs have made solid progress. Most excellent news. Yeah. When we first returned here, I was unsure what we were going to do with the ruins of this place. But if we can get the cathedral rebuilt, we'll have it looking just like old times soon enough. Okay, whatever. Strategically speaking, our best move is probably to head for the Kingdom Capital. Though, I think it's more likely that Lady Rhea is in the Empire, so I would not object to taking the fight directly to Edelgard. Hmm. There are no right or wrong answers in war. Yes, there are. There are extremely right and wrong answers in war. What do you think we should do? I hope we
Wait, what? Was a knight to the royal family of Fargus? What was a man like that doing in Garrig Mock, I wonder? Who knows? Whenever I try to ask about it, he'd change the subject and avoid giving a proper answer. He was hiding from his family that he abandoned. I think. Yes, really. Now get out of my way. Owl. Really like that owl. I didn't have to be an owl. Why couldn't it be a hawk? Hawks are cool. Owls only. I take that back, they're not lame, I just don't like owls as much as I like hawks. I can't believe the Valley of Torment. I'd heard of it, but I never expected to go there. It's exciting. I wonder what the landscape is like. It probably is dangerous, but I still want to get there. Someone... The Valley of Torment lies on the border of three noble territories. The kingdoms Fraldarius and Galatea families, and the Alliance's Daphno family. Incidentally, the Galatea family was originally an offshoot from the Daphno family. What did some... Not the meat. It is being all moody. This seems, but I feel. No. Well, the monast when we fr but if we can. I'm not sure. <laughs> really? Hey. It has been only. past fun but I want no that just <laughs> I concur meeting re in that <laughs> it also means I'm sorry just I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna find so you're not a teacher Someone... You lost something once, too. Professor? Might as well. Professor, a pl I've never been very good at praying. I was here to confess my foolishness. <laughs> Which one? While I'm at it, May I confess something to you, too? Whatever. I realize what a burden I've been. On you, I mean. After yeah. every breakup, I neglect my work. And I know how that affects you. Oh, uh, dude, really? 
I'm completely worthless as a woman. Can you imagine how that feels? I don't know you're completely useless. Oh, I'm going to be single for the rest of my life. I just know it. Yeah, not my problem. You think so too, don't you? <laughs> Why? I'd rather you disagree, even if you don't mean it. Lie to a woman when she's down and out, yeah? <laughs> I couldn't help it. I just had to say yes. What's wrong with me? It's not my mother. A looks. lot of things. I'm still gorgeous. <laughs> or am I? Be honest. Do I look old? No, not possible. I'm the songstress who swept the Empire off its feet. Men professed their love for me hourly. It can't be my looks. It's not your looks, it's your personality. You're right. Although, just fine is a bit... Well, it's better to be attractive than just fine. I don't know. I, I, I don't want to hit any of your... You know. Oh, no. If the problem <laughs> isn't my looks, and they are not the problem, then it must be... What? My personality? Bingo! I know you're trying to find a way to say it gently, but you think there's a problem, don't you? You're a little high and mighty, and you drink too much. I suppose I can be a bit unkempt. A bit is an understatement. I do have a short temper, and I may be a little lazy, sometimes. The first part I agree with, the second part, a little more than a little. But I've always heard fellas, you know, like a woman with a few flaws. They're flaws? And they're just downright... Uh, I don't know, what's the word I'm looking for? Defects. No, I don't think that's the word, but I'm gonna use it. Seems to me there are plenty of flawed girls who have landed themselves a good man. Yes, but your flaws are extremely bad. So maybe... My trouble is I'm not imperfect enough. Do you think I could use a few more flaws? Oh dear god, no. Are you saying I'm perfect as I am? Come now. You'll make me blush. I did not say that! <laughs> She gives me a headache. Figuratively speaking. <laughs> nice job. Hey, well. Um. Yeah, I didn't think so. But, you know, I had a try. Mm. Really not appreciate it. <laughs> oh, it was hers. Welcome. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? 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 Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Come back soon. <laughs> 
Yeah, no. I'm going to assume that things only go up to 50. Yeah, I'm super up here. Oh, yeah. Now, apparently the fish of mystery. <laughs> so I need to catch that. I will catch you, fish. And then I shall catch you. Nope. 
guess. Almost. Um, No, wonder perfect. Nope. No, go away, fishy. It didn't go away. Yeah. Wait. 
One fish, fish, red fish, blue fish. Is it blue fish? Red? No, it's red fish. No. Nope. Okay. That would have been a guess. It's the brand new confess, but for some reason it would not take the confession. Uh Nope. Nope. No choice. Again. Good to win.
Perfecto. But at least I'm not catching magic herbs. Yeah. 
times and then I'll I didn't mean that. You've done me a great service. This one? You're all set. Oh. See you again soon. It's working. What now? Yours? No, you don't get a reward. Nothing 
to get excited about. I've... <laughs> no problem. <laughs> Thanks for the help. I did... Thanks for the... I'm glad I'm getting better. I guess I've got some talent. I still I've done business in before is deeply affected by the war. I was thinking of selling food there now. How should I go about it later on? We can handle it. Very well, if we must. Oh, have a look at how we did. Yay. getting it perseverance is the key I suppose it's working Set my sights. Bye. 
Oh. Let's see. Let's read this here. As I like it. So, yeah, we're reading somebody. Uh, but I'm gonna end it here tonight. It was, thank you for coming to the stream. And, uh, yeah. I'll probably stream tomorrow. Maybe. Uh,. So I'll see you guys tomorrow, and I hope you have a good night. Well, I might see you guys. Good night.